Hi, Stephen here from Inexterious Painters and Decorators, and you're watching Inexterious TV. In this video, I'm going to show you how to stain block over watermarks on either walls or ceilings. Let's do this. There are two areas on this hallway ceiling that have got water damage. Let me show you how we fix them. The materials that I'm using for this project is some oil based undercoat a mini red roller, an inch and a half paintbrush, a roller pole, a paint kettle, a paint scuttle, a nine inch roller, a selection of paint brushes with a three inch and a two inch, and some white Johnson's vinyl mat. What I like to do is cut in the bit in between the wall and the ceiling first with an inch and a half brush, and then get my roller and roll the oil based undercoat and cover all the water stain. Because the undercoat takes in between 12 and 16 hours to dry, what I like to do is give it a coat first thing in the morning and then give it a second coat last thing at night because it will be dry enough to be able to give it its second coat and then that way you know the stain is totally annihilated. There are other products out there that dry a lot quicker, but I just prefer to use the oil based undercoat because I know it's never let me down. It's covered every stain that I've ever done. Now I've left it to dry overnight, I can now paint over the oil based undercoat with some white matte emulsion. Just to let you know that once you put that first coat over the undercoat, that area that you painted will take a bit longer to dry than normal. So you'll have to wait a while before you can second coat it. But here I am now second coating it. And there it is finished. No more watermark. Now we've moved on to the second water damaged area in this hallway. I consider this to be a lot worse than the first one that we did. But just like the first one, we apply two coats of oil based undercoat one in the morning at eight o'clock and the other at 20 past four in the evening just before we leave and then that will be ready to apply its first coat of emulsion the following day and just to let you know in the middle of all this I managed to fill and cork any gaps or cracks I mean if you want to do all this in the same day then shellac based um, Zinza stain block is probably the best but if you're in no rush undercoat is definitely your next best alternative and I use it all the time and it never has let me down sorry about the camera angle here I do apologize but I'm now giving it its first of two coats over the top of the undercoat and just to let you know and to remind you it does take a little while to dry over the undercoat so when you think it's not drying just be patient and it will dry. If you would like to purchase the undercoat and some of the tools that are used in this um, video please click in the link in the description below. And I just want you to know before you attempt to do anything with stain block make sure you fix the initial problem first which could be a leaky roof or a burst pipe and this is the second water damaged area all fixed that is a stain block watermarks on either walls or ceilings if you've got anything from this video please like share subscribe please hit that notification bell and feel free to leave a comment down below thank you very much Thank you.